A film project has captured aerial views of more than 100 Hakka villages across Taiwan. The filmmakers used drones to explore a never-before-seen perspective on many of Taiwan's oldest buildings. Their footage reveals details of the architecture and daily life of Hakka people in the 19th century. The Hakka Public Communication Foundation project aims to preserve Hakka stories for posterity and shed fresh light on Taiwan's diverse cultural history. From the air above, Jiangshe ancestral home in Xinju's Beipu, the edges of a thousand red roof tiles glimmer, reflecting the local architectural style. The HPCF drone team spent 18 months gathering footage of more than 100 Hakka villages all over Taiwan. We shot more than 100 films of more than 100 places. In the past, what people knew was touring places on the ground. There was no viewing them from above. So people didn't know that the craftsmen of yesteryear had expressed themselves so meticulously on the roof of every building. Since the HPCF was founded in 2019, its blue classroom van has toured all over the country, promoting traditional Hakka culture. Last year, the film team was dispatched to find 100 of the most beautiful Hakka sites and document their unique architecture and cultural import for posterity. On the west coast, Yunlin's Zhang Liaojia temple has a unique red and blue palette, here recorded from a rarely seen angle. The drones have visited the southernmost Hakka village, known as the Old House of Xiao family in Jadong Township, as well as the east coast Old House of the Zhou family in Fuli Hualien. This diversity of buildings from north, south, east and west recount the stories of life on this beautiful island. We've spent 18 months surveying almost all the historical buildings from Hakka areas across Taiwan, and I think that we want to go out again and film once every 10 years. The project has recorded the traces of Hakka tradition on film for future generations, preserving a vital strand of Taiwan's cultural heritage.